What's up guys, Ankle Spangin here, and today we are playing as Quinn in the jungle. And I know uh, some of you got... Wait, wait. We're jungling. We're jungling. <laughs> Alright, let's grab that. Let's grab our refillable potion and head over to the jungle. Now, this is um, something that I have seen played a couple times but I haven't actually played it myself yet and for some reason uh, because of all my friends playing it, it made me kinda wanna just give it a try just for the heck of it so that is what we are doing I know I did play Quinn recently um, but you know whatever and two things just real fast before this game really gets started that I would like to uh, talk to you guys ask you guys for uh, more ask you guys of just two little favors for me one um, just because I, I was just thinking about this earlier in the shower, um, I know a lot of you guys watch my videos without actually hitting the like button, because the only time I even remind people is at the very, very end of the video, um, so if you could do that, if you do, only if you enjoy the video, of course, but if you do enjoy it, just hit like, it's a very quick button to hit, helps me out tremendously, uh, it's just another way to support me and let me know that you enjoy what I'm doing, and then also, other than that, I would like for you guys to uh, follow me on Twitch again now that I am able to stream because I would love, 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 love to get back to streaming for you guys much, much more frequently. So a huge leash coming in from my teammates. Thank you very much, teammates. That is massive. Let's go ahead and cue that. Get the Harrier. Bounce off him. Get another Harrier. And we'll go ahead and just kite this guy around. And we'll use a stack of our refillable potion real fast here. You know, let's just bring him over here, go ahead and hit him like that. And apparently that actually, like, blinds the big minions, I guess. That's pretty cool. So good kiting there. Going to be able to get the uh, full blue buff with taking very little damage. So good job, us. Let's go ahead and run over to this red and see what we can do. But, um, anyways, as far as the following me on Twitch thing, that'll just let you guys know via email whenever I go live on twitch.television forward slash ankle spanking. Um, and like I said, I really do want to stream a lot more for you guys um, now that I'm able to again. So, really looking forward to that. Let's go ahead and use our other potion here. And I think I'll go ahead and drop the Q, drop the autos. One more auto and we'll smite them. There we go. Easy pickup on the red buff, and I should be able to get level 3 off of this guy right here. So let's go ahead and grab our W, because I do know that uh, this does actively give, a, uh, give me more attack speed and shit. So, better movement speed and better attack speed whenever I attack a vulnerable target. It looks like, damn, it looks like Fiddlesticks already got this one. Good lord. Well, let's go ahead and just gouge him real fast and see what we can do. Now, I don't know about the likelihood of level 3 ganks. I might try, actually, because it's a Lucian mid. Um, so that would actually be relatively easy, especially when he's up this far. So there's the barrier, Lucian with the heal. Hey there, buddy. So, woo, that's going to be boom. There's the kill. Using the flash and the vault. Picking up an easy kill with Perdun also going to be grabbing... Quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of good stuff out there, because he was the one that got him to bust all of his summoners. I actually just reset my Harrier on accident, so that was my bad. But still, terrifically done all around. Had to use my Flash, but Lucian used both summoner spells. That opens up a lot of uh, a lot of chances for me to get them. So let's see. There's the exhaust. That's gonna be the hook right there. Let's go ahead and jump on this guy. That's gonna be there's the vault knocking him out of that. There's the Harrier. He has no Flash. One more auto. And there's the heal, maybe? There's the flash auto! Good shit by Ash! We'll be picking that up. Go ahead and get another Harrier auto attack. Get some more Harrier auto attacks. So there goes like half of her health in exchange for a bunch of my health. And I'm okay with it. So I'm actually gonna just push with them uh, just a little bit here. And then we'll see. If Blitzcrank can land a hook, we'll kill her. And he did not land the hook, so no big deal. But we can still work on this tower. And maybe... I really feel like we could dive her, but that's still iffy. That is still iffy. Blitzcrank would have to be the one to tank, and that is exactly why it's iffy right there. That guy. So, going to go ahead and just, you know, scout the skies a little bit with my W there. And uh, go ahead and go back. So, I can actually grab this entire thingy, and I can upgrade my potion. So, we'll do just that. And that will be quite a big, big back for us. 
There's nothing else I can really buy, so I'm just going to buy a pink ward just to, you know, be able to assist more with the vision. It looks like pink ward is probably having a good time up top with Fiora, I'm sure. Apparently, he really is, because he's already 2-0 and up there. Good lord. So, let's see. We are level 4. We have gotten two very successful ganks off. Uh, time to go back to farming a little bit. And that Lucian mid is something that I actually really enjoy doing myself. So, I don't blame him for, you know, wanting to do that. So, let's go ahead and just bounce off this guy here. After the Harrier auto attack, use our smite real quick. And, of course, we are getting the uh, Skirmisher Saber because I do really like that smite a lot more in general. That's not to say it's 100% always better. And since he just uses dash, he is a very dead Lucian. Let's go ahead and throw that Q right there. Boop, pick up another kill. No problem. Just walking in on him. And as soon as we saw him use that dash, it was very, very easy pickings for us. So Pink Ward actually duking it out with Fiora. And let's see. All right, there's Fiddlesticks. No need to go try and find him yet. Let's drop that Pink Ward. And let's see what we can do with this poor Fiora being chased down. I'm actually going to throw one of my Trinket Wards in here as well real fast. Because I would like to see if I can do something to um, do that uh, what's-her-face. Oh, there goes her parry. So, oh, there's a ward in here, though. So, not going to be able to pick up the kill like that. Now, let's go ahead and get this Scuttle Crab. So, nope, not going to mark it. Okay, okay, Valor. Okay, I see you. Well, let's go ahead and start killing this. The blue buff should be up very, very soon for him. Uh, I may have actually warded that just slightly too early. As a matter of fact, so a little bit of a shame, but what you gonna do? And let's see, let's go ahead and just W that. So I don't know if Lucian was paying attention, but looks like he was not. So let's go ahead and throw our abilities. Miss our Q, that's pretty not good. In fact, that's uh that's enough to make me actually miss that. Oh damn, I was trying to stay on that wall so I could uh actually be there. Uh-oh. <laughs> Anyways, I was trying to say I so I could actually be there for the shield. But, uh, totally my bad. If I didn't miss that Q, that would have gone a lot better. But, uh, as you saw, I missed the Q. And that's... <laughs> that is where things went sour. So, my bad on that. We'll be providing our team with three deaths at once. And let's go grab our blue. It looks like Fiddlesticks actually started red. Weird. Very odd. Fiddlesticks never start red. That's very odd. Interesting. But after we get our blue here, we should be able to maybe gets level 6 and then we'll be able to gank a lot more because level 6 is kind of like you know why Quinn is strong right now in the jungle I'll hopefully be able to show you guys just why she is as strong as she is at the moment I'm actually not gonna bother using my smite on this so let's go ahead and cue that before he hits me and I think he still got the hit off on me anyways and we should walk away when he's actually blinded like that but it's fine so actually not going to get level 6 off of this we may have to do it off of the Grunkalunk. Let's go ahead and throw this Q. Make sure he's blounded, blinded, blinded. And boop. Bounce off of him there. Get another Harrier stack auto attack thing. Throw a Q in his face and that will be. There it is. Now we can get behind enemy lines. Now what this does just makes us run fast. So, I like running fast. And let's just see what we can do. You know, this is a a good idea they definitely know I was coming with how much they were backing off like instantly they definitely knew I was coming so it looks like I actually baited Ash there whoops <laughs> so oh well what you gonna do go ahead and just boop that's gonna be a bounce off of him there's the skirmisher saber let's go ahead and throw this Q right there use the auto attacks flash auto him one more time that's gonna be the kill easy pickings and let's go ahead and stand behind enemy lines and get right over to our red buff and let's get these potions ticking, because I have quite a few Hunter's Potions that I am not making use of. So, run right here, drop the Q in his face, and bounce off of him right there. There we go. We'll go ahead and just keep walking with him. Drop the Smite to get some health back, throw the Q, get the auto attack, and that will be another very successful Quin gank. And apparently, uh, wait, can I? Yeah! <laughs> I actually didn't know if I could do that or not. But, um, that's good to know. Very good to know. So go ahead and throw another Q. Kill him right there. It looks like the teleport coming in. And we'll actually just run up here. I'll throw my heightened senses out. And I'll just chill here while I, uh, whoop. Go away. Stop that. Stop it. <laughs> Jerk. So I thought she was going to try and, like, all in me there. But, nope. Nope. Wait. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Enough of that. Oh. 
That was one of those things that, uh, even though you saw it coming, there's not really anything you can do about it. So, a little bit of a shame there. Fiddlesticks at least uses Flash, so there is no more of that. It looks like Pink Ward is getting ganked, so he's probably just going to be able to get out. Knowing him, he's just going to fly out of there somehow. But, we are up. We have our stand behind enemy lines or whatever, stand behind Braum ability. And look at this, just with tier 1 boots, 536 movement speed already. So, Valor carrying me around, and we'll be able to go gank. So, let's... They tried to dive him, and it went sour. Imagine that. So there's the Shiv right in his face, taking a bunch of his HP. And let's see, so... Oh wait, they totally know I'm here now, because I just ran in vision range of that minion. Whatever! The hook will land! That's going to be ba-boom! Boom! There's the Q picking up the kill! Even with the depth charge, go ahead and use the heightened senses. Show them that I don't give a heck. And, alright. Oh. Oh. No, I'm not going to go for that. I thought about actually, like, charging through the tower. I don't think it would have worked. So I was, for some reason, really hopeful in my mind that those minions wouldn't hit me. And I don't know what was giving the impression that they might not, like, even have a slight chance of not hitting me, but I was really, really hopeful. And that's okay. Let's go ahead and use our ultimate again. The issue with ulting so much is that it takes a lot of mana. Um, so I should be using my Hunter's Potion quite a lot more than I am. And, you know, that's totally my fault for not doing so. But what you gonna do? What you gonna do indeed? So let's see. Go ahead and grab that back. Look at all this mana we're getting back. And then we just use it again because we wanted to use our ultimate run a little faster. Let's see. Oh man, he is... He is a little... He's a little low up there, and I kind of want to gank him. So, because usually, for whatever reason, Pink Ward just doesn't die. Yeah, kind of like that. I don't, I don't really know how he does it, but he does it. So, boo! That's going to be boink. Some good damage right there, and one more. Boo! Boom! Come on! Come on! Not going to be able to get that kill, but very, very close. And let's see. Fiddlesticks is on his way up here, and maybe we can do something. So... Fiddlesticks is going to try and ult from somewhere, I'm sure. Nice! Nice! Rip. Damn it! Not going to get that kill by bouncing the damage off onto the little Fiora. But, you know, we tried our best. So, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, never mind. He stopped running after me. Nice! <laughs> Lucky day! So, it looks like he will be trying to do something and totally making an absolute fool of himself. So, good job, Pink Ward. I knew you well. So maybe, maybe we can do something with this Fiora. I think this is really iffy, though, because, uh, you know, Nautilus is up here, Fiddlesticks was up here, so I think I'm just going to take the, uh, the safe choice here and back off, because I don't really feel like dying at the moment. So let's see, maybe, uh-oh, Lucian going hard, and let's see if maybe we can find, what's his face here? So what we're going to do is we're actually going to run behind this guy and knock him out of that. Let's see. Well, we're not really knocking him out of anything, but he is going to tank those raptors for us. So thanks, buddy. Look at all this damage going off on him, but there is now a Nautilus there, and that's not good. But you know what is good? Let's see. We'll just walk out. That's what's good. <laughs> so he is going to take my Crimson Raptor, but that's okay. That is A-OK. -okay. I thought Perdon was going to be okay, too. Guess not. Guess, guess not. So maybe we can get a Caulfield's Warhammer or... Or a BF Sword. You can go for a BF Sword. That sounds fun. That sounds pretty fun, but I don't know if that's the choice I want to make right now. I know I really want a Yomu, so I'm going to definitely go for that. Uh, let's grab a Serrated Dirk and another Longsword. Go ahead and pop our ultimate in the base here so we can get that increased movement speed and the uh, mana back from being on our fountain. 4-2-1 and one so far with Pink War getting that top turret. That will be good. Looks like the farm in mid is actually in Perdun's favor. Bot lane in our favor as well. Great job, everybody. Um, it looks like they are going to be getting another kill down bottom. Or was... No, that was totally mid. I forgot Lucian's the mid laner. So it looks like they're just killing everyone. Keep it up. I'm gonna... I'm gonna do this thing. And then maybe I can do Dragon as well. So... Uh-oh. Fiddlestix is dead. So, good night, Fiddlestix. Elmo Jr.'s on that killing spree. Go ahead and throw this Q at him. And apparently the Dragon doesn't give a heck that we throw a Q at him. So... We'll just do this dragon as fast as we can, using all of our abilities whenever possible. 
mid lane turret will be going down. We do have Blatz Kronk in here. He is going to tank a little bit of it for us. Thank you, Blitzcrank. Let's go ahead and smite that. Throw this Q right there just to get Miss Scuttlecrab running away from us. Bounce off that big old booty of hers. And we'll go ahead and just take away those resistances. Killer ass. So, behind enemy lines, coming in. And let's go grab our red buff and see what else we can do. Getting somewhat close to that Yomu's will be another good um, breaking point for us. And from playing this so far, my immediate observation is the fact that... Um, it's pretty easy to gank the people that are, like, generally not as hard to kill. Does that make sense? Like, when I'm ganking Fiora, it's kind of a lot harder to kill uh, because she has her repost. When I'm ganking, you know, fucking Lucian, it's pretty easy to get a successful gank off on him because I don't feel like I'm going to get murdered. But it looks like he will be getting murdered by the rest of my team. So let's go ahead and throw our W right here. Not going to be spotting anyone. But can I... F Actually, I don't really want to find Fiddle Six right now. As much as I want to sit here and tell myself that I do, I really don't want to. So let's go ahead and grab that. Another Scuttle Crab going down for us. And I might as well get Hunter's Potion ticking right there. Oh, wait, I forgot. It automatically uses one when you're full stack. So let's see. Let's see here. Hello! Boink! Go ahead and bounce off his booty. That's going to be a kill right there. Finding the little bony man. Wait. Scarecrow man. Not a bony man. We'll go ahead and cue that. Just kill all of those. Get this minion. Get, excuse me. Mini onion. How dare I mispronounce. So let's see. His red. His red might actually be up. So I think I'll go. I think I'll take a peek over there. The hook will not land. And let's see. Oh. His red buff is up. You know. This is probably the worst. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. And whoop. Boom. You made a mistake coming this way buddy. Going to bounce all over that dick. Turn that ass into grass, and I am the lawnmower at the moment. So, back on duty to go grab this red buff, because I really want this red buff. Hey, hey, this is a little risky now. So let's go ahead and do it anyways. So, go ahead and just bounce off that, and boink. Man, that was a pretty easy steal for them. But I'm glad they didn't take it. So let's see, no ward there for, well, am I, by no ward there, I mean there's no one there. That's why I meant to say, not no ward there. And actually, I can get, ooh, I can get my Yomus now. So that'll be really good for us. And then next up, I might go for a rapid fire cannon just for the fun of it. But we'll find out. We will find out indeed. And I actually don't know, I want, does rapid fire cannon make my vault make me bounce further off if it's fully charged? Because I know vault always takes you to, um, you know, like right about where your max auto attack range is. But I don't know if it applies when you have rapid fire cannon. So either way, we have our full Yomus now. That's going to be a shit ton more damage, some more armor pen. Pink Ward with the double kill, and his little Shaco clone is just going to chill there, bouncing daggers a little bit while he's dead. And then Explosion with the, you know, Blades of Glory flying into the sunset, riding over the Rocky Mountains. So go ahead and cue those guys. Kill that one, and we should be good on killing that. And let's see. I bet I can just murder this Lucian straight up. He just uses dash. So let's go ahead and pop our Yomus here. Drop that, and that's going to be so much damage. Who cares about missing our skill shots? Look at that damage. <laughs> so bouncing off his face, showing that I don't give a heck. And let's just murder the entire minion wave while we're at it, too. So that Yomus damage, holy shit. Not giving a good goddamn. So let's get these Hunter's Potions ticking and show them that, you know, we want the HP back. So whoop, go ahead and kill all those and boink, bounced off of that. And let's see, maybe we can do a little more. Uh, no, nah, I don't really want to try. I just want to, oh, that's going to be some good damage. Kaboom, there's an easy kill. Good job, Perdun and Blitzcrank. All I did was pop caps in the ass, but, you know, that's irrelevant. So let's see. Let's see. If Vayne... Vein... Oh, God damn it! Come on. Come a little closer to this wall. Woo! That's gonna be... Kaboom! There's the kill! Jumping over that wall with the good use of our vault. Getting that burst in there. Nicely done. So let's see. If this fiddle six goes for an ultimate, I'm about to flash vault off his ass just so he can... Uh, you know, Ooh! Almost actually still getting hooked even with his flash. That would have been gnarly. But let's go ahead and get out of here. 8-2-2. Two, and two. Per done with a big lineup. Not going to be getting, you know what? They're probably fine. Yeah, yeah, they're fine. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, they're not fine. He died. 
Yeah, they're fine. So let's go ahead and grab BF Sword here. <clears throat> Wait. Wait, it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, I was going to say, do I want the BF Sword or do I want the Rapid Fire Cannon? But then I saw that they surrendered anyways. So, just going to you know, all over their faces right there. Pick up that victory. Quinn Jungle, it's confirmed. It's broken. Um, and I do actually recommend you guys try it out. I actually had a very good time doing that. So, that'll actually put me a level 3 with Quinn. Nice. But 8-2-2 uh, two and two with low CS because we were the jungler, but still an A-plus rank. Probably not super high on the damage, but decently up there. We were, in fact, decently up there, so good job. I will take it. And here's the ending builds for you guys. If you guys did enjoy this video, do make sure you leave a like and favorite. It really does help me out. If you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. I'll throw you in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. It'll be a wonderful day. Peace!